Hey, James. What, Jamie? You know what time of year it is? Mm. Oh, it's Christmas time! That's right. What do you like for Christmas? Mm. I like pie. You like pie? Yeah, I like pie a lot. I like, I like pie too. Yeah. I think we like pie. <laughs> This is James and Jamie here with Two Guys Take on Food, and we are Two Guys Take on I Like, I like Pie. pie. Uh, we're doing our Christmas special here at the Claremont Village. Uh, anything else? No, I think that's good, because I'm looking forward to the pie. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're here at I Like Pie, and I got the uh, chicken pot pie. Mm -hmm. It's a uh, uh, organic and has uh, many uh, organic vegetables. Mm -hmm. And uh, you got the... I got the shepherd's pie. It's a combination of uh, ground turkey with some uh, leafy greens and all that kind of stuff. I've never had them before, so I'm kind of looking forward to it. I, I like shepherd's pie. You're, you're going to like that. And I also got, also got these uh, two uh, little goat cheese bite things. Mm -hmm. And we're going to give them a try too. Yep. Okay? Looking forward to it. Here we have the sweet pies that we're trying. Uh, I have the pumpkin cream with, uh, with, uh, with a praline crumble right here. Mm -hmm. This is a uh, pumpkin cream cheese cho with chocolate, chocolate chips. Chip bite. Uh, that is coconut cream. Mm -hmm. This would be the pumpkin pie uh, pie that they have. A little bit of whipped cream on top. Uh, then we have the dulce de leche pie with a little bit of French vanilla on the side. Mm -hmm. Oh, you hear it? I like pie. They're getting yes. I like pie. We don't just like pie. We love pie. We love the pie. I. We still got. We still got. Here, look. We still got plenty of pie to take home. And all of it was excellent. All of it. Oh. Uh, so, where do we start? I think what did you have? I had the shepherd's pie. I went in here thinking, you know what? I'm not sure I'm gonna like shepherd's pie, but you're getting chicken pot pie, so I'll get it. And I said, oh, shepherd's pie was really good to begin with. Right, right. And uh, that was just encouragement because I had some, had some bad experiences before. Oh my god, it was great. I had a nice um, inch and a half of the potato, uh, mashed potatoes as a crust, right? And the top was really nicely toasted. It was the really crunchy, and the bottom half was the potato that went well with the lightly soft meat. It was really good. I would definitely recommend it again if you want like a light lunch or just something about a cold day. That's something we really <laughs> would give it to you if you want something like that. More. And I had the chicken pot pie. For a savory pie, it was nice and hot. It was good because uh, the, the crust, it wasn't that heavy. Um, it was really light, it was really airy, and uh, flaky. Mm -hmm. and just like a good pie crust, it should be. And it, it, because, of, because of that, it, it just, oh my god, it was, it was so good. <laughs> yes. Yes, this is going to be a recurring theme through our show today. Oh. So, uh, <laughs> the savory pies or sweet pies are next? I was well, that was, those were the same pies. Same pies. Now we're doing the sweet pies. Okay, yeah, pie maestro here. Um, sweet pies. I had uh, this dolce de leche pie. It's a nice apple crumble with uh, a little dolce de leche mixture on top. Wow, it was good. Really good. It, it, you had it all remote too. Yes, I did. It had a nice French vanilla on the side, so you had the apple crumble with the uh, uh, cinnamon spiced uh, dulce leche on top, which itself is sweet, really nice mix because the dulce leche goes in the apple. And the French vanilla is like a little opposite taste that melts in quite literally. Oh, get it now, get it yesterday. It's good. Oh, uh, and I have the uh, I have the uh, the pumpkin cheesecake with praline crumbles on it, uh, and all mode as well with um, the salted caramel ice cream. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, it was, it, was, it, was, it, was, it was so good. It was so good. So good. Uh, I, I don't know what else, what, what more I could say about it because it, it was that good. 
a recurring theme here, anyone? And, and I also got the uh, little tartlets, the, yes. the little pilots. And, uh, and, I, and they brought some out from the back and they said, like, well, I got some eggnog here. And I said, you got eggnog? Well, I'll, I'll try the eggnog. Right. They, they, only had one, they only had one eggnog. And I had it. Oh my god. He was generous enough to give me a small piece of it. Now, I'm about to say, I say as a guy who hates eggnog, my dad had eggnog for every Christmas, and I can't stand the smell of it, let alone the five feet of it. I had a bit of that, and oh my god, that's easily the best thing we had today. Easily. Easily. Oh. And that includes the pie. Well, I was also thinking about for lunch, but you know, oh. we, we won't go there yet. <laughs> Oh, okay. oh, oh, whoa, whoa, that, that hurts. <laughs> but, uh, but the eggnog was, uh, it had a, it had a, a small bite. The, the, the eggnog custard mm -hmm. in it was, was, uh, was really, um, it was very strong with the eggnog flavor. Yes, it was. And it wasn't a bad thing. Yeah, because it was really, really good. Yeah, it wasn't a rich that overpowers you. It was just a good flavor that you're sitting there savoring and going, yes. Now, we also got, now, like I said, we also got some, uh, we also got some um, pies here that, that we have to take home just because we're full. There's so much good stuff that we couldn't take it all. And... Oh my god, we're, we're still full. <laughs> Man, I mean, this is a great store. It has a great atmosphere. I mean, you, you were talking about how it's only like 300 square feet or something in a retail space, but man, they put it together well. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it's Christmas. Eve. Yeah, they got that Christmas theme up. Their menus are on paper, like wrapping paper. It's, it's pretty nifty. Well, uh, 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 not only that, uh, everything is seasonal. Everything. Yeah, okay. So, uh, so the, the pies that they made, all the sweet pies, are are, are seasonal with, with fall season. So they were made with uh, with Thanksgiving and with Christmas in mind. And so. And even within that, it's seasonal to whatever fruiter they're trying to include the pie. Like I wanted some blueberry. It's gonna be some of my favorite. They don't have blueberry outside of. I think it was made in the end of summertime. June. June in the end of summertime. And summertime. June first is on my calendar. Believe me. <laughs> oh my God! And uh, what else? Uh, oh, the service was freaking awesome. Oh, yeah, they're they're sitting here bantering with us, having a good a good time with us as we're eating this, while they're still taking care of us with the pie. And they were very knowledgeable too. Very. Uh, because you know, same face. Well, I don't know about this, but then they they explained it all, and they were right. <laughs> Yeah. Um, price, walked in thinking it's a bit more expensive than you think it should be for what you get, but then, oh my god, it's all <laughs> good. Easily worth what you pay for, easily. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, the atmosphere price, uh, I will come here again. Yes. I would bring a friend here because I brought you. Yes. And I would bring a date here. This will be a, this will be a, a really nice if you're walking around the village, the Claremont Village. You, you know, you can go see a movie at the uh, at the movie theater. You can go have uh, dinner elsewhere. Or, you know, at, at one of the other. Like you, you go to Walters and have dinner, and uh, don't have dessert there. You bring her here and you have dessert here, and she she would she would love you. He speaks truth. <laughs> So yeah, um, overall, excellent, come here, just do it, order anything, really, and you will like it, it's that good. It's that good. Um, anything else? I think that's it, we're thoroughly satisfied with I Like Pie. I love <laughs> And, uh, well, hey, we just want to say Merry Christmas, and have a Happy New Year, and if you don't celebrate Christmas, uh, have a wonderful winter season. We'll see you in the new year. See you in the new year. Mm. What do you think of the uh, chocolate covered cherry pecan? I loved it. It was amazing. Um, it was like a, an explosion of chocolate on the inside. <laughs> it was probably the best pie I've ever had.
<laughs> that's high praise. That, that's saying a lot. Fortunately, one of my bakers told me I had chocolate on my forehead before I came out. Oh, that would have been sure. I know. <laughs> uh, so, uh, Annika, uh, you own uh, I Like Pie, and we hear it, I Like Pie. That's right. Because yeah. I like pie. <laughs> uh, I really do. Uh, and the pies that you make are fantastic. Yes. Uh, do, you, uh, do you do any of the... Uh, do you, uh, you, make, you make them all from scratch? Indeed. Uh, nothing frozen, nothing uh, canned or, or anything like that? Well, we occasionally will use frozen berries, uh, particularly because berries are, um, they're such a short season yeah. for them. And when they're fresh, they're often the quality of them is not as good as an individually quick frozen type of berry where they freeze each one individually and it really maintains the shape. But um, we try as much as possible to stick with seasonal fruits so that um, what you're eating is as close to what we can get locally as possible. That's why you know blueberry is probably one of my best pies, but you won't find it this time of year because the blueberries, of course, are not available as fresh as they should be. Yeah, Jamie, Jamie said that uh, because he wanted he wanted a blueberry pie. He didn't have any blueberry uh -huh. pies. And me, I love blueberry, and I said, no, you don't have them, but no, yeah. So. No, you have to come back. I make the best blueberry ginger and blueberry sage. It really, I think, it's probably one of our. Most unique. Well, we, we, when we have to come back. Then? Well, you have to come back in. I'm thinking by June. I should be able to start getting some good berries. All right. So, June. Yeah, absolutely. But we have a really fabulous winter berry um, that we're doing right now, and that has some sage in it. Too. Oh, I know. I, I, I've try tried. It? Oh, I've always tried the winter berry. <laughs> you, you know, it's like, oh, you got to try this. I've already tried it. It's right. great. Good. That's what I like to hear. Um, let's see. What, what other questions do we have? Uh, um, you know, I Like Pie has been open for like... Six, almost six weeks. Six weeks now. Mm -hmm. And it, it, is business good for you? Business is fabulous. We love Claremont. Um, our location was something that, I mean, we sort of started with the town of Claremont and then worked into the concept for the pie shop, but we always knew we wanted to be here. Um, it's a really lovely town. It's just, um, the ambiance is very nice. We feel like our, we have the right kind of... Uh, concept for this clientele, um, laid back, friendly people who really are appreciative of oh, hard work. Friendly people. I know. There they are. Yeah. You know, she's always trying to get me to buy my pie. I know. Right. Samples, right? They're, they're, yeah. So, what did somebody call our, our pie bars? They call them the gateway drug. <laughs> because it's just like, well, if you're not ready for pie, you try one of the bars and then you're hooked. Oh, yeah. Oh. I, I, I'm going to go to work here. Uh, <laughs> um, well, really, uh, really, that's all you want to know. Uh, you, make, you make excellent pies. They Thank make you. excellent pies here. And you've got to come in and, and you've got you got to meet the staff. You got to you gotta eat, uh, eat their pies. You got to get their Dr. Bob's ice cream is mm -hmm. is like fantastic. It's very nice compliment. Yes. They go go all mode. It's like oh. It really is. We have some nice pairings. We try to make sure that the um, ice creams that we bring in complement the seasonal pies. And we were talking earlier a little bit about you know the nature of our ingredients. We really do stick with all natural. We don't use, of course, no preservatives. So everything that we have, I mean. Fortunately, we're busy enough that we sell out most of the time, so we don't have to worry about this. Um, but really, our pies, we make everything every day in our kitchen. And we have a lot of people that walk in and wonder where all the pies come from because they can't see how big our kitchen is. But we, we produce a lot of pies. Yeah, it, it's like as big as the front door. Yeah, it's bigger. bigger mm -hmm. even because it, it seems like a really small shop. I know, it kind of is. And, you know, we really wish we could see more people because we find more people want to sit. But um, it was really important to us that we had a facility back there where we could produce as many many pies as we knew we could sell. Yeah. So. Well, that, uh, that when the summer or spring gets here, you know, you've got the outdoor area. Here. Absolutely. You, know, you, get, you get some of those tables. Right. Bring them right over there. We can't wait. Oh, yeah. I can't wait. Either. I know. You have blueberry pie. We'll have blueberry. <laughs> lots of reasons to come back. Absolutely. Uh, lots of Good. We've enjoyed having you in. It's really, I mean, anybody who takes an interest in us is, for us, it's very exciting. Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. Well, that's it. Uh, I uh, wish everyone a Merry Christmas or a Merry Happy Christmas. Hanukkah or, or Kwanzaa or Saturnalia or, or whatever. <laughs> Just have a really nice winter season. Okay. All right. Happy New Year. Oh, happy New Year. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> in our shop.